History made with Seth Rollins leaving the main event of greatest cash in ever and only proves that Seth Rollins has always been the visionary. WrestleMania has always been the place where the impossible's made possible, where dreams become a reality. And that was never more apparent than at WrestleMania 35 in New Jersey, when for the first time in its history, WrestleMania was main evented by the women of WWE. Ronda Rousey arrived in WWE like a tornado, first impressing in her debut at WrestleMania 34 before steamrolling her way to the Raw Women's Championship at SummerSlam 2018. The former MMA champion looked unstoppable, using her wide array of throws and arm bars to hold everyone at bay. As Survivor Series approached, Becky Lynch, now SmackDown Women's Champion, would be set up to compete against Rousey. Unfortunately for Becky, she'd be replaced by Charlotte Flair after Becky was taken out of action following an interbrand brawl on Raw. At Survivor Series, Charlotte would show a vicious side in a disqualification loss to Rousey. Becky, however, wanted this fight more than anything. At the 2019 Royal Rumble, Becky Lynch would enter the match in someone else's place, ultimately winning it all by eliminating, you guessed it, Charlotte Flair. But before everything could be finalized, more bad news for Becky, as an injury to her knee led to her not being cleared to compete at WrestleMania, and WWE would replace her with Charlotte Flair. Becky would not sit by and just let that happen, however, and ultimately got her kidship. The surprises were not done, though. Shortly before WrestleMania, Charlotte would shock the world of sports entertainment by defeating Asuka for the SmackDown Women's Championship, and now the match would be winner takes all meaning the winner would be both Raw and SmackDown Women's Champion. Three of the most talented women on the roster looked to dazzle the world in the first ever women's main event at WrestleMania. Can you go out there and be the last kicker we all know Becky to be? Or will Charlotte and Ronda prove to be too much for you to overcome? Time to show everyone who really is the man. Ronda Rousey was the obvious target for Becky and Charlotte, but Ronda immediately went on the overwhelmed Charlotte and Becky with her blitzing offense, but Becky was able to compose herself quickly enough to avoid another Piper's pit, leaving Ronda on the defensive early in the bout. With Ronda out of the way, now the queen and the man had the ring all to themselves. With Ronda still down, heatedly slamming Becky's face into the mat. Charlotte was making the most of Ronda Rousey being down, 
willing to put Becky through the mat if it meant she'd leave WrestleMania as the Raw and SmackDown Women's Champion. While her attempts at getting the pin failed both times, Becky was now in firm control and didn't show any signs of letting up. exactly what needed to be done in that ring, looking to get the pin when she saw Ronda down. The queen was in top shape, and despite not getting the pin, she was rolling.